And here we go again. Welcome back, fellow Minecrafters. This is Spellbound Caves of X Map. I am Miss Pink, your hostess for the evening. And uh, we are now at the intersection two. I've made it a little bit more homey. I put it some blocks in the floor because I fell through already once. If you can see, I had to build a staircase up. And it's hidden right back here. And there's nothing special down there that I can see, but I miss a lot of stuff. So who knows? Who knows? I mean, the rest of our 117 wool might be down there, and I'm just not seeing it. But I've placed a bed in here for sleepy time, and I have a chest that I'm going to just move some stuff into for now. And I'll do most of this stuff off camera, but I do have this all set up. And it looks like, other than that, I am ready to go. I've got some funky enchanted gear on. And we have our Zestonian battle sign, which is rockin'. I am full up on torches, and I do appreciate <laughs> the little hints and tidbits that I get from my viewers. And I was informed that I use way too many torches, but I don't care. They keep me safe. So now that I have my coal and my wood problem under control, I will. I don't know. Probably putting them up and driving people crazy, but I like the light. It keeps the baddies away. So, last time, what have we done? We have uh, tested out our rail system, so we've got fun little minecarts that go back and forth so there's less running for when I die. You know, I don't have to run so far back. And um, this is the Grove of the Dark Willows. And we poked around in here last episode just kind of checking it out, maybe kind of laying some uh, light down to get an idea of what we're coming into here. And we managed to find the lime green wool. Kind of a surprise for me. And again, I felt like it had been unearned, but, you know, who cares? I got it. And it is back at the monument. So we are four wool in. And a, like I said, 117 left to go. And there is more. Look at that. I've, oh, oh, oh. Taking advantage of me when my back is turned. Hang on, hang on. Hey, who? who? Oh, it's one of these guys. I don't know. These guys are seriously tough. I know. Like, you know. Lon Chaney Jr. tough. Not that Taylor Swift kid or... Taylor Lautner, whatever his name is, that whole crappy Twilight series. Come on, Wolfie. Let's do this. Seriously, I have to hit this guy like seven times with my awesome wicked battle sign. And it doesn't help that I set him on fire and then throw him into water, though, so he's not getting those extra damage ticks. Anywho, so we were in here earlier and kind of went all around the outskirts and... Oh, look, he gave up. How good of him. No, come back here. I want you to die. I want you to die. Get over here. Yeah, I know what you're doing. I've, I've been over here. I know what's over here. There are a ton of um, blowy uppy guy spawners. <laughs> what are the blowy uppy guys called? Creepers! There are a ton of creeper spawners. I better stop jerking around here. Look at I'm almost dead. Oh, oh. Do you, do you mind? All right. Oh yeah. Okay. Well, you too. Just ganging up on me. Come on, get up here. Oh my God, I cannot die this early in, and I'm so far away from my hidey hole. Oh, creepy gonna kill me, and I'm dead. Okay. Okay. But I slept in that little bed that I had placed, so you know, it's not even run. It's like a jog to get my stuff soon as my terrain loads. Oh, and then just oh, for uh, safety's sake, I blocked off the other two ways because, you know, I, I get antsy and I didn't want to peek in there and kind of know what was coming up. So to keep me from doing that, I blocked it off. And yeah, I know I can use a pickaxe and go in and check it out. But, you know, I'm just, it's, it's the honor system is what it is. Okay, so here's all my crap, and I'm going to run over here real quick, and put it all back on. Oh, maybe not, maybe not. Oh, there's my, oh, I have my battle sign. I got it ready to go. Come on, come on, skinny. Let's go. All right. 
Yeah, that fire aspect thing is wicked. Okay, sorry. Roughly five seconds while I put this crap on myself. La, 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 la. Yeah, oh my god, I might just have to edit this part out. I take so long, but things have to be where they belong, or I can't play the game! Okay, my bread's not there. Okay, oh, just in time. Hi, Wolfie, hi, Wolfie. There. Is this the same one, or do I gotta, like, hit you 40, 11 times, too? That's okay, though. These guys drop pretty awesome things. Ow, ow, ow! Figure out what you're gonna do. This is not helping me progress anywhere in my episode. So, oh. he puts himself out. I can only imagine how long this would take with like a a stone sword. I mean, got like an epic sign. Oh, good. Did you drop? Oh my goodness! And he drops stone crap. What a crock! Okay, here we go again on my own. Ooh, that's a fancy little waterfall. Makes me wonder what's up there. Yep, I might have to check that out. And you can see the outline of some trees and a lot of areas that I have not lit up. And what we did come across before was there are a ton, and I mean a ton of spawners around here. It was complete and oh, oh. <laughs> utter insanity last episode because I mean I was no more than turning around and there was another creeper and another creeper and I managed to neutralize one of their spawners and you know what here's the problem I have run around so many times now I'm not really sure where I am Oh, wait. Okay. Anyhow, last time we were here, we found a little red brick and glass house that happened to have the lime green wool in it. And like I said, I didn't feel like it was really anything I worked for. I think I more or less stumbled across it um, on accident. So makes me think that there are definitely more things here to be found. I just have to, well, clearly I have to find them. Hey, hey, what are you doing? Okay. Overshot, overshot. Come here. Whoa, 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 what was that? Oh, it's a wraithity thing. <sighs> okay, okay, regroup. Ooh, I want to go up there, I betcha. I betcha, I betcha. It's all dark and sinister, and that would be my next spot, probably. Anyway, um, I have a tendency to ramble and then forget what I'm talking about. But we found the lime green wool, and it unfortunately was not the next wool, wool in the series. We are missing our yellow. So I think I went the right place. I mean, I think I'm in the right spot. I just... There's another wool in here, I think. I think, I think. And I figured there might be something cool up here. But I might... Oh, look it, look it, look it. Oh, yes. It's that female intuition thing. I knew it. This diving helmet could be really useful here. Well, maybe it could be. Diving helmet. All right. Oh, respiration, aqua, affinity. See, I don't know. You know, because I lost my other diving helmet before I really got to try it out a heck of a lot. So I'm wondering if it allows, um, I know it allows like more breathing, but I don't know if it allows you to, um, like, let's say harvest. Harvest isn't the word. Uh, mine. And manage to get things faster when you're submerged underwater. So, it's either something I will look up, or it's something I will figure out, or it's something that I will take to the grave wondering. It's all... It's all, uh, a mystery. Okay. So he wants me to use the diving helmet here in this little wading pool. Woo! 
It's like a water slide. Water slide. Do it. Do it. Does that mean there's something in here I need to defend? Ouch! You bastards. Okay, well, you know. We'll figure out the Aqua Affinity helmet later. <laughs> jumpity, jumpity, bounce, bounce, bounce. Yeah, you just look at me from down there, would you? Oh, and I gotta eat. Sitting up here ain't gonna do a damn thing if I'm hungry. <laughs> I tell you, the effects of this sword, just, they crack me up every time. I love it. So we've been on top of the waterfall. I managed to get a diamond helmet. I'm really slurry tonight, and I haven't even had any cocktails. Ah, blow up, blow up, end on fire. That's it's a deadly combination, but not for me, cause I'm awesome. Hey. And there's these big old trees, so I'm not sure. Um, hi. Uh. You Thanks. Oh, that's a lot of tree. Anyway, you know, what I'm trying to do is I was hoping to get some sort of feeling as to where to go to next. And it's really hard to know where to go to next when I can't get my bearings <laughs> in the first place. So I'm really hoping to find the little hut that I found earlier the, where the wool was and uh, kind of... Oh, there it is. Oh! Hells to the yeah! There it is. Okay. This is a beginning. Alright. Let's... Oh, there's already a torch there, but you know. I love my light. put torches up here? Can things spawn up here? Okay. So here we be. And I'm gonna put this thing right here and I'm gonna pop it down. And we're gonna torch it up. Okay. So I mean it's hard to really kind of figure out what's going on when there's all these stinking vines. But this place is where I got the green wool. And we're going to go back down because I can't see an effing thing up here. I do recall, though, that there were a bajillion and one creepers. Oh, oh, and this here is the site of my, ow, might have to use it, my hidey hole, my hidey hole. Good to know where that is for now. That looks like a chest with a piece of sand on top of it. Or it isn't, and I'm going to just run over there for no reason. Oh, it definitely is. Another chest. And a zombie to kill a zombie. Die, zombie. You know, I think I've played Minecraft long enough that if we had an actual zombie invasion, like apocalypse type thing, I'd totally own. Okay. Okay. Oh, oh that sign was right there. Oh my goodness, gold sander. Gold sander. Bane of death. And I don't know what the little blurbity block underneath means, but that's a beauteous sword. Oh my god. Oh, love it. That was totally worth coming over here. Ew, go away. Maybe he doesn't see me. Ugh, they're just disgusting. Die, die, alien. Bast monkey. I'm seriously trying to watch my language. I was informed. And you know I don't name people here, but I was informed that I'm a little bit of a swear bear and that I need to tone it down. So I'm trying. Maybe you noticed in my last video how I yelled good gravy. I mean really? What am I in fourth grade? Okay. I don't know where Looky there! Looky what we got here! We got a dolphin, and dolphins are beautiful and they're my friends. But that Mr. Dolphin is 
Oh, he's just wedged under there. Okay. Here I thought there was like the secret water passageway and that's where my diving helmet was supposed to come in handy, but no. Oh, I was hoping for something a little exciting this episode. Be I totally hear blazes again. Should I dig in the floor? Okay, that was pointless. Okay, so here's what I know. We've run around the entire cavern and I have lit up everything that I can think of. I've climbed trees and the things that were stumping me were, you know, why does there have to be so many vines that obscure my view and that diving helmet. So I'm back up here. I came back up here to reassess my diving helmet area because I felt like I was missing something very obvious and I found this and I am planning on going up now. I don't know if this is where I need to be, but I swam all around the bottom looking down and couldn't find any thing and I hear skeletons. So we are definitely Oh and a creepy in the right place. Okay. I was supposed to swim up. See I never think outside the box type stuff. Kitty. Look at all the mushrooms. Hell yes. I'm going to be making me some mushroom soup. I was so worried too because I probably light this up as I go. I've been running out of food and I hate the idea of zombie flesh because it, first of all, is disgusting and it poisons you. Woohoo! Are you kidding me? This is a cavern of mushrooms? and something else. Oh, oh, maybe this isn't gonna be so bad. I was worried that I was gonna have a, a zero episode here, but we might have something over there. But I gotta collect these mushrooms first. Collecting mushrooms. Because mushrooms are just mush and rooms. If you have not seen that college humor video about mushrooms, you should seriously look it up collegehumor.com and then mushrooms. <laughs> Makes me laugh every time. Okay, well I think I have collected enough mushrooms and I want to know what's over there. So, let's go check it out. Did I totally lose it already? Where'd it go? Oh, pfft. I was on the way. Looky, 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 looky. I love glass. I love glass. And I don't see any pressure plates on the floor. Yay! You figured out the hint. Bunny face. Alright. Still don't want to go in the room because it really scares me. And we have yellow wool. Woot! Okay. Well, awesome. Let's get this back. Actually, I'm going to sign off here because I'm going to collect some more mushrooms and get back. And that was awesome. Very cool. Thank you very much for joining me. And until next time, behave. Bye.